this day? Ten, no, I think it's 11. Don't, what's today's date? The 10th? Then it's Vlogmas Day 11. Going to a pizzeria that's like New York inspired. So, and this will be our first time going there. So we'll see how it is. What else? What else are we doing today? I wanted to go to this flea market. That's what it's called. It's a flea market inside Giant Stadium in the parking lot. I'm like zoning out and I can't tell. Okay, it's not myself. Um, but what? You know when you like zone out and you can't? What you, know, you mad for? Put none of this on there. I might snippets. <laughs> Why are you so mad? Not mad. You look mad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, daddy looks mad on no. Alright, we're almost here. We'll talk to y'all later. <laughs> okay, so we just got back home from where did we eat day? What was the place called? I don't know. Me neither. I mean, it was really um it was really good and I saw a picture of the cast of Law and Order on the um, on the wall and they had like signed their autographs and stuff so they have eaten there before so that was pretty cool. El Forno is what the place was called, El Forno. Yes, El Forno. And it was really good, it was really, really good. But now we're just back at home and about to watch Army versus Navy. Army versus Navy. Do you want it back? Football game. Yeah. We're just chilling here for the rest of the day pretty much. So in our house we don't have an actual office and so I made, I ended up making, hi, I ended up making a makeshift office in our, what would have been kind of like our, kind of an eat-in, I don't even know what you would call it, like our breakfast eating area. Um, but since we have a formal, a formal dining room, we didn't see the need to have two eating tables. So I made this area off of the kitchen, kind of our office area. But I wanted to share with you guys specifically this piece that we have. It's like a garland, but it is silver and here, let me get closer. It's like a garland, but it's silver and it has like these little pearl-esque uh, beads on them. And then the leaves are just really pretty. But I hung this on this back wall. This big piece is from Ashley Furniture Home, Ashley Home Store Furniture, Ashley Furniture Home Store. Um, and then, normally it's just without the garland, of course, on it, but during the holidays, I kind of wanted to spruce it up a bit and make it a little bit like prettier and a little bit more festive. So I put this garland on it. I might put an actual like wreath up there too, but I just thought it looked really pretty, but I just wanted to share with you guys a way that you can kind of spruce up a certain area in your home and make it a little bit more festive but not have to do a whole whole bunch of the area because it we didn't put like any other christmas kind of decor in this area i just hung that there and i kind of feel like it just made it look a little bit more festive so then i would share when i got my garland with you guys and kind of do a um decorate with me video on how i decorate my mantle and I received my garland from Pier 1, and I'm not sure if I like it. So I kind of wanted to get on here and show you guys it to see what you thought I should do with it, if you think I should keep it, or if you think, yeah, it doesn't really match my decor and that I should either exchange it or kind of just nix the garland for this year and then just do it really a good one next year. But this is the garland. This is the garland that I got. I kind of left it in the bag because it's flocked a little bit, but most of it is glitter. I don't know if you guys can see that, so I don't even want to take it out of the bag because I don't want it to get everywhere if I'm not going to use it. Um, but tell me what you guys think. Do you think I should use it? And it's a lot more sparkly in person than it's looking on camera for sure. Um, but I don't know if it's too, like, they're like chunky. The sparkles are just so chunky that it's not like a fine sparkle. And that's what I was wanting. A fine sparkle mixed with flocking. But that's not really what it is. Let me know what you guys think. I think I should keep it and kind of just work with it. Maybe add a little bit more flocking over, like with that flocking spray that you can buy at the stores and just add that over the sparkle parts to kind of dim the sparkle down or if you think 
that it just it it's a little the sparkles are a little bit too chunky and i should just it, either exchange it or kind of nix the garland idea for this year and just do it big next year because my mantle does look pretty without it too so let me know what you think You've given me really good ideas in the past um so i thought i would ask you guys again so let me know down below what you think i should do with the garland so we are just chilling at home watching the heisman selection presentation so that's gonna be it for today's vlog thank you so much to all of the new subscribers on my channel i really appreciate you guys subscribing um <laughs> i'll see you guys tomorrow bye, bye.